Hey YouTube, it's your girl, Shari Nicole. I just got a question. Where do you go when your emotions are all shooken up and nobody, is no, nobody in this world understands why your emotions are all shooken up? Or do they not care? My uncle recently just passed away. I have no clue what's going on. Nobody made a phone call to let me know. I had my cousin happened to call me, and she happened to let me know my uncle on my daddy's side passed away. Don't know nothing. Where does the broken-hearted people go when their heart is broken and nobody's telling them anything? Do we continue to play guess who, or do we pray about it? Me myself. I'm holding on to God's hands because my heart is very broken. My emotions are very shook into the core. And I don't have many people I can count on. One of the ladies from my church, well, some of the women at my church, you know, I had to announce what was going on with me. But one of them in particular this morning decided to give me strength. Because right now my emotions are all over the place. Because this particular uncle, we didn't get along. He called me out my name and it broke my spirit. So I quit talking to him because I was hurting inside. Because I got tired of people stealing my joy. And never asking me permission. Can they take it? They just took my joy. So I no longer associate myself with my family because it's too much to function. And I don't want to be a part of that. I want to live in peace. And I definitely want to hear Jesus' music. By that I mean I don't want to be a part of yelling and screaming and fighting. And everybody telling me, you too loud. Or you shouldn't be doing this or you shouldn't be wearing that. What gave you the authority to tell me this? Who hires you to tell me what I can't do? So you telling me I can't be myself around you. So I got to apologize for being me. You don't get the right. So my uncle just died. And I haven't heard nobody's voice. Just the women at my church. And my cousin had to announce it to me. My emotions feel like a bag. A brown bag. Somebody poured a bunch of stuff in and shook them around. And now I'm trying to sort them out because I don't even know how I feel about it. So I'm trusting God because I'm scared out of my mind. I'm debating if I even can go to the funeral because I don't have strength right now. So all my strength is coming from Jesus Christ. From the bottom of my heart, one of my sisters to go to church. This morning she sent me a message. She don't even know I needed that message more than I needed water to drink today. Because it gave me strength. Because I was so weak. I was so thirsty. And she gave it to me. You'll never know when the heart is weak and the emotions are everywhere. I don't know if I should cry. I don't know even know if I should just go to go in my closet and call out Jesus. But I do know I got to pray because I need strength and I need it to come from somewhere. And I know God can only, God is the only one can give me strength right now. Won't well, nobody understand my pain because I, I wasn't very close to my daddy's side. I'm mainly close to myself because when God made me, he made me original. That means I don't do what everybody else do. I don't follow nobody, and I don't dance in nobody else's beat but Shari Nicole's. So that caused a lot of conflict, and a lot of people got words, most of them judgmental. It ain't nothing been good said about me because nobody understands me. The only person in this world that understands me is Jesus Christ because he created me. And he didn't make no apologies when he made me. Because he knew that I was going to be different. I never smoked a cigarette in my life. I never had a drink. 
I ran this race with all my heart and my soul. So I had to learn how to protect myself because nobody else in this world was doing it for me. So tomorrow I'm debating if I should go see my mama. Because I know she knows my voice and she knows my heart. And I know she'll fix my emotions and she'll fix my heart. That way my emotions won't be all over the place. And I need somebody to talk to that understands my heart is broken. My emotions are shooken. The last time I seen my uncle, he was a white. As y'all say, he was a pale. And I knew he didn't have long to breathe. And I knew God was coming to visit him and to see about him. A lot of y'all won't even understand my emotions. Because my whole entire family is defunction. Because all they want to do is argue, fight, and dog you out and disrespect you. I no longer want to be a part of the disrespect. But I want to be a part of the respect committee. So I fight every day to find out where does broken hearts go. I'm trying to figure out where do I take my broken heart. Who will hold my broken heart when I can't hold it myself? Who will show me what to do with my emotions when I can't do it myself? That'll be Jesus Christ. Right now, I just need a friend to tell me it's going to be okay. So I know Jesus Christ is going to be my best friend because nobody understands how I feel right now. I'm getting ready to pin my uncle down. I have no clue what's going on. Nobody's made no phone calls. I can't find my sister or my brother. So I don't know what's going on. And right now, I need all the strength Jesus got for me. I don't know who to talk to about my emotions because nobody in this world will understand what I'm going through. And I don't really care if nobody watched this video because you know why? These are my emotions. And people don't care about nobody's emotions nowadays. They're too busy caring about themselves. And God made me to love other people like it was my last breath. But he also taught me that you got to protect your own heart. Because people don't care about nobody but they self. When you selfish, you get selfish things in this world. That means people start treating you unkind. People start doing things they ain't got no rights to. I just want to say, I pray to God my uncle get rest. I pray to God he understands I forgave him for what he did. For calling me out my name. But it's okay. He's with the Lord now. I pray he rest up, and I pray that he understands that this journey had to happen. Will I sleep easy tonight? No, nope, my emotions are all over the place. My heart is broken. My emotions in a, in a brown bag, shaking around. Y'all have a blessed night. I had to release it to the world, because I'm hurting right now. And I know some of y'all like, why she got it on YouTube? Why she got it on YouTube? You ain't got to watch it. You don't. Sometimes people need to release their emotions. And right now, I just want to talk. I don't want nobody to give me no advice. I don't want none of that. I just want somebody to love on me and tell me it's going to be okay. Because this storm won't last forever. Where does the broken heart go when the emotions are all over the place? God bless you guys.